Hey everyone, it's Mike Adams here. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to set up your payment gateways inside of Kartra. So that way you can accept payments right on your website um, for any uh, digital products or services that you may be offering to your clients. So first things first, over here on the left, um, you come down here to where it says My Integrations, give that a click. And the two most common payment gateways that folks are using online is either PayPal or Stripe. And that's what I'm gonna show you how to set up in this example. There's a step-by-step -step process for each of them. And so all you gotta do is you scroll down here and let's do Stripe first. So here's Stripe. And first thing you click these little dots right here and then you can uh, hit the plus for new integration, okay? And if you'd like the technical, do uh, technical documentation, it's right there for you if you want it. But again, I'm gonna walk you through this step by step. And what this is showing you is um, you need some information. So to integrate your Stripe into, your, into Kartra, it, you need your secret key and you also need your publishable key. And so let's jump on to Stripe and I'll show you exactly where to find that. And then you can pop that information in here and you'll be good to go. So here is one of my Stripe accounts here. And over here on the left, you see where it says developers? You wanna give that a click. And again, hopefully you've already set up your Stripe account, uh, otherwise you won't be able to access what I'm accessing right now, but you wanna go ahead and uh, completely set up your Stripe account. Uh, if you don't already have Stripe and you wanna use it to accept payment, there'll be a link below this video where you can get yourself set up with Stripe. Uh, but either way, if you hopefully have done so and have that all set up and you're ready to go here, uh, you see where it says API keys? Go ahead and give that a click. And this is where you're gonna find that information. Remember, it's asking you for your secret key and your publishable key. So the first one that we see that's automatically visible for you is your publishable key. And here it is right here. And of course, I'll have this grayed out um, on the video. But all I'm gonna do is take this uh, under, underneath where it says token and copy, uh, it's a super long letters, numbers, it's a big old code. And I'm gonna go ahead and control C and I'm gonna copy that come back to Kartra and I'm gonna pop that in right here. That's the publishable key, okay? The second thing you need, go back to Stripe and you see where it says, you know, secret key and it'll say reveal live key token. Go ahead and give that a click and it will reveal your secret key, okay? And this is unique to your account. So it's not um, a, a token that you wanna give out or uh, make available online, okay? This is purely just to uh, track your payments. You wanna keep this very private. Um, and then go ahead and copy that, okay? Control C, and I'm gonna jump back into Kartra, and I'm gonna add it right here into secret key. So I got my secret key in here, I got my publishable key in here. I'm gonna go ahead and click create, and just like that, okay, uh, it is now integrated. So this gateway for Stripe is now integrated right here into Kartra, I can click the X right here. And it'll show me right here that I got the check mark here because the integration has been added. So later in this video series, we're going to show you how to set up some pages, how to create a product where you can accept payment. And I'll show you uh, where you can actually select now a Stripe so that way people can you know, pay with a credit card right on your website. So let's go ahead and as well set up PayPal. Now again, some people just use Stripe, okay? Some people just use PayPal. Some people like to offer both. And for this video, I'm gonna show you how to set up both so that way, whichever way you're going, uh, you'll be taken care of. So let's go ahead and scroll down here and here's PayPal, okay? And slightly different process. There's a few extra things we need to do here to set up your PayPal. But uh, starting with the little dots, give it a click and then click new integration. And the first thing it's gonna say is connect PayPal. Okay, so I'm gonna click this blue button and it's gonna ask me to log in to my PayPal account. Okay, so I'm gonna log in here with one of my PayPal accounts. Okay, I'm gonna click log in. And I'm gonna log in right here. And so what it's asking you here is it's asking if you wanna grant permissions to Kartra. And so there's a couple of things that it's you know, wanting permissions on, but essentially if you wanna be able to use uh, PayPal on your Kartra websites, you have to grant these permissions. So I'm gonna go ahead and click grant permission. And then from here, it's actually going to redirect me back to Kartra. And so it's now showing the email address for the PayPal account that I was using, but there's one more thing missing here. It's requiring a PDT token, that stands for Payment Data Transfer, okay? And we're not gonna get into the uh, techie stuff, uh, but you need your PDT token here in order to finalize this integration. So let me show you how to find that in your PayPal. So 
we're gonna jump back over here into PayPal and I'm actually gonna log in to the account that I used to set up this integration. So essentially re-log into your PayPal account. And the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna click the gear over here and you're gonna to go to account settings, okay? Once you're in account settings, you're gonna scroll down a little bit and then over on the left hand side, you see where it says website payments. We're gonna give that a click. And then you're gonna come over here and you're gonna to go to website preferences, okay? And we're gonna click update. And what this is gonna do is it, it allows your customers after they make their purchase using PayPal to be redirected back to your Kartra page, okay? And inside of the technical documentation, and here it is right here back on Kartra, you can click this and it's gonna kind of walk you through kind of the definitions and the why, right? Um, but back here in PayPal, again, just to keep a video and keep this video, uh, just to keep it short and sweet and keep this video concise, um, what you're doing is you're setting it up to where you just wanna have your people redirected back to Kartra. And from here, you're gonna scroll down, okay? And you come to this payment data transfer section, okay? Make sure it's on, right? And you will see your identity token. So here's your PDD token right here. You're gonna grab this, okay? You're gonna go ahead and copy it, Control C. So I just highlighted it, copied it. Okay, of course I have it blanked out for the video. Uh, and then you're gonna come back to Kartra and you're gonna put that PDT token right here. Okay, control V to paste. And then I'm gonna go ahead and click create. And as you can see, um, we have saved successfully, so we're good to go here. So this payment gateway is now configured. And uh, you can see now by the little check mark uh, right here that uh, this integration is activated and we are good to go. So just like that, guys, we've been able to integrate Stripe and also PayPal, so that way we can use either of them or uh, both uh, to accept payments, again, for your digital products or for your services that you might be offering on your website uh, using Kartra. So hopefully you guys found value in this training and in this step-by-step -step walkthrough. And if you have not already signed up for Kartra, you can click the link below this video and you can get yourself a $1 uh, 14-day trial to Kartra, it is the most powerful uh, tool that, uh, that is available online right now. Uh, Cause again, it's an all in one tool that allows you to run your entire business. Uh, again, just using one tool. For many years, I had to use multiple tools to run my entire business. It was very complicated and uh, uh, very, very tech intensive. And so for those of you guys that are, especially if you're not, if you're not techie, uh, this is a fantastic tool to use because again, you have all your data, everything you need all in one place. So again, if you don't already have a Kartra account, go ahead and click the link below this video and get yourself signed up for Kartra. Uh, but that's it for this training, guys. I will see you in the next video.